www.pondscape.us I don't know how clear this is going to be. We got a news chopper hovering. Or this could be for expressit.net too. I'm sure you can hear the chopper. Might be a little hard to see on here. It actually looks bigger in person than on here because the zoom on this isn't uh, all that incredible. I, I guess this thing's a little far-sighted. I don't know. Maybe that's to help with something or other. I have no idea. But you can sort of see it. And um, it's been hovering in this same vicinity for a while. So I'm guessing that... Um, some sort of shit has hit the fan someplace and they're providing a news feed live to some sort of a local channel. Although I suppose it could be a pre-record for um, the evening news. This is definitely a news chopper. I would need some pretty powerful binoculars to be able to tell what station. Plus it would have to, the line of sight angle would need to be pretty good. Um, as far as I could tell from this LCD screen, um, your view of this thing is gonna be like, you know, real, like just this little bitty tiny chopper dead center of the screen here. Well, for me, from my in-person view, it practically looks like I can reach up and grab the thing. This thing is so far down that I can see its freaking landing struts as if they were tree branches. I can see the front wheel of this thing, or the front strut, whatever it's called. So I can see the, the, the main front strut in the front, I can see the two sides, you know, the mechanisms it uses to land. I can see the, um, the top rudder. I can see that spinning, although the camera's probably not going to be able to catch that very well. And of course, the um, the rear one is smaller, so it, it spins so amazingly fast that um, it's damn near impossible to see. I really wish this thing had more than a 4x zoom. Because, I mean, this thing looks like I could just reach out and grab it. This is pretty freaking low. It seems to be getting lower and lower still. So your view on this might improve in a moment. I don't know if another bank got robbed or if there's a serious car accident or what in the world is going on. But news choppers don't just hover in place for no apparent reason. There's obviously a story to cover. Unless it's something really nasty and it's a complete a, a, a police SWAT chopper with a sniper rifle aim, aimed at uh, somebody. That's entirely possible as well. But it's most likely to be a news chopper. As we're, on, as we're almost at four minutes here. Watch, just my luck. Right when I decide to stop this thing, it'll get like even closer for like a perfect shot. And I'll be like, damn, why did I hit the stop button? Fuck! <laughs> Unfortunately, this isn't one of those things I could go up on my roof to get a better view of because it's on the wrong side of the house to where I have access to the roof. This is in the front. My access is in the back. So the trees, which are right here, would be blocking my view, which would have been through that way. So unfortunately, this is the best angle I can get on this for my viewing YouTube audience. Again, I wish this thing had a better zoom on it. This chopper from the in-person point of view here it looks like I could just reach out and grab the thing. It's actually pretty neat. Most of what we see zipping around with this good of a visibility is jetliners going back and forth. Very rarely do I have this good a view of a helicopter for this long.
I mean, this is Chicago after all. Um, it's adjusting its heading. I don't know if it's going to go lower, higher, or what the heck it's going to do. Out to find out. Ooh, I guess they are leaving. Either that or just swinging around for another pass. There it goes off into the distance. Let's just wait and see for a sec if it's going to swing around or if it's going bye bye. Oh wow, is that another one over there? Or is it a second one? Man, oh, and then there's another freaking chopper over here. There must be some serious activity down over there someplace. At least I think that's a chopper. Looks like it. Yeah, so there's like two and three freaking choppers out here. This is, yeah, this is another freaking chopper. This is like helicopter freaking central. So one went off over in the other direction. Yep, it's another chopper. So there's one. There's another one over there. Yep, it's another chopper. What in the world is going on? I'll probably hear about this later, whatever it is. Yeah, I don't think it's military. I don't think the world's ending quite yet. <laughs> so it's got to be news. Ah, oh, that one's even, this one's even closer than the other one was. Holy Badungi. Crazy. You got to understand, this is Chicago. Helicopters and prop planes and things like that are probably a more common occurrence out in uh, in Bumble Screw in the middle of Bumble Screw nowhere, but um, in Chicago, this isn't very common. It's save for you know a news chopper that's just passing by, like doing the weather or something. But that's higher up and really quick usually. Um, the only time something like this usually happens is when there's a story, a big hot story taking place, like right freaking now. You got the swarm of frickin' news choppers. There's one still over there. I don't know where the third one went. This is nuts. There's gotta be something. I'm guess I'm guessing either I don't know, if I had to guess intersections for where something was happening based on their height and the and the visibility from from that height. Um, if they could see you pretty far ways and based on their angle, I would have to guess that either something's happening maybe around um, Harlem and Addison or um, Addison and Oak Park um, or maybe um, Narragansett and Belmont, you know, somewhere in, the, in that vicinity. Um, way west to, to, to southwest so I mean I'm pretty familiar with my area and um, I've been up in helicopters before so I mean I I know how the whole like height versus distance thing works so yeah that's that's my educated guess anyway I'll be able to tell better later on when like the story breaks on the news or whatever but we're hitting up on 10 minutes here almost and YouTube only supports 10 minutes so www.pondscape.us www.expressit.net whatever I decide to put it on already